Hey, welcome to Electron Online. In this video, we're going to do a second example of how to calculate the velocity of one item relative to another. So here we have the Earth. We have two spaceships, one that's trying to get away and the other one that's pursuing. And notice that their speeds are relative to the Earth. So 0.8c relative to the Earth and 0.6c relative to the Earth. So it does look like spaceship one will be catching up to spaceship two. So the question is, how fast is spaceship one approaching spaceship, spaceship two as seen by spaceship two. So what is the velocity of one relative to spaceship two? All right, so here we have three velocities. We have first the velocity of the event as seen by the stationary observer, the velocity of the event as seen by the moving observer, and the velocity of the moving observer relative to the stationary observer. Wow, how do we do that? Well, we need to assign a stationary reference frame to something, we need to assign a moving refer reference frame to something, and we need to call something the event. So since we're trying to figure out the velocity of spaceship one relative to spaceship two, maybe we should call spaceship one the event. So let's call that the event. And let's call the Earth the stationary reference frame, since we were given two velocities relative to the stationary reference frame. So this becomes reference frame S. And then let's call this spaceship the moving reference frame, because we want to find out the velocity of the event relative to spaceship 2. So let's call spaceship 2 the moving reference frame. So we'll call it S prime. All right. So now we have to define U, V, and V prime. So those are the three variables. U, V and V prime. Now U is the velocity of the moving reference frame S prime relative to the stationary reference frame. So that would be U. That would be this velocity right here which is equal to the velocity of this spaceship. So we can say that U is equal to 0.6 C because that spaceship is moving at 0.6 C relative to the Earth and since we made that the moving reference frame we call that the speed of the moving reference frame. Okay, V is the velocity of the event relative to the stationary reference frame. So V is the event that would be right here, and that would be this speed relative to the Earth. That means V, V of the event, as seen by the stationary reference frame. So V is equal to 0.8 C, which means we're looking for the velocity of the event as seen by the moving reference frame, which is V prime. So in this case, we're looking for V prime. All right, and we have the equation for V prime right there. And notice that you can, you can start with one of these equations and algebraically derive the second and the third equation. So it's not like those are three different equations. Those are three equations of the same type, just written in different form. In each case, this one is solved for V, this one is solved for V prime, and this is solved for U, but they're all three really the same equation. All right, so we take the middle form, V prime is equal to V minus U divided by 1 minus v times u over c squared. So let's plug in some numbers. v is equal to, where are we? Right here, 0.8c, 0.8c minus u, which is equal to 0.6c, 0.6c divided by 1 minus v, 0.8c, multiplied times u, which is 0.6c, all divided by c squared. And now we simply have to Simplify that, so we can already see that these two c's will cancel out this c squared. So this becomes 0.2c divided by 1 minus the product of those two. And that looks like it would be 0.48. So this is equal to 0.2c divided by 0.52. And 0.2 divided by 0.52 is equal to 0.385c. So that is the approach speed. So even though to the Earth it appears that the difference in the velocity is 0.2c, when the observers in this spaceship look back and see this spaceship approaching, they will see this space, spaceship approaching this spaceship at a speed of 0.385c. So much faster than we would think from observing from the Earth. Again, quickly, what we're doing here, we're looking for V prime. V prime is the velocity of the event, which is this spaceship, as seen by the moving reference frame. Use this form of the equation. You plug in V and U, they're both positive, but we're supposed to subtract. They're both positive, but we have a negative sign here. This is 0.2C and 1 minus the product, which is 0 0.48, 0 0.52. And there we go. That is the final velocity. That's how we do that. 